Yo, cuz, how is it going? It is almost done. I believe this is the last episode for this beautiful playthrough we've been doing. Oh, fuck, did I? Okay, never mind. Hold up. For this beautiful playthrough we have been doing. And uh, I can't believe it's almost over. And like within like 10, 11 episodes, it's already done. Once again, the game itself is very short. You know what I'm saying? That is not to say anything, of course, right? Um, it, once again, it was only the first game. And y'all know what the fuck it is. We don't have much to do left. All we have to do left now is to go to Arsif, um, talk to King Richard, the Lionheart. And kill Robert de Sable in an absolutely epic fashion. I'm gonna use only my hidden blade and annihilate everyone. Just you watch, okay? I've been practicing, alright? I, I got I got it, I got it. Alright, anyways, here we are. So yeah, now we just have to straight up go to um fucking what do you call it? We're going to the kingdom now because we have to ride to Arsif. It's a completely new area. It's not really an area like a city, it's not a city, but like it's like an area, a new area essentially. Remember, it's like maybe like a ton of guards and stuff. What the hell is going on? Anyways, I don't think, yeah, I don't think they're suspicious of me no more because the mission is done. Sabran is dead. Did we just kill Sabran? Yeah, I think we did. Did we? Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. It was someone else. It wasn't Sabran. It was Sabran. I don't know. I remember. But, um, yo, I'm like fucking Joe Biden in this shit because I get, I get like mad dementia every, every now and then, I swear to God. Like, I forget shit. It's kind of, it's kind of, uh, it's kind of worrying to me. And you know what? Might as well do a good deed while we're on our way. Might as well do this, you know what I'm saying? Fuck me. Okay, yeah, we'll practice our hidden blade kills because that's what we're doing right now. We're gonna kill a hidden blade. Yeah, we're gonna annihilate all of them with the hidden blade. It's gonna be sick. Just watch. Right? Okay, wrong. There you go. Obviously, don't just stand there. Grab them, throw them, and then shank them. Easy, like that. Fucker. Get over here. Throw them here on the ground, and then easy shank. Simple. It's a, sim it's a simple method, of course. The high level enemies will not let you gr throw them, but you know, um, they will attack eventually. And when they do, using our cat-like reflexes, we will counter them. I'm not an expert. I just love the game, okay? That's that's all there is. Like, I, I don't even claim to be like a pro gamer. I just like games. It's a passion of mine. I like it, you know what I'm saying? Simple as that. Fuck me. There you go. I still got it, buddy. I still got it. No retribution for you. Anywho, so yeah, all we have to do is go to Arsef, kill Robert de Sable, and then he will reveal the truth to us. That, oh boy, your mentor was behind it all along. And I'll be like, no, how could you? Right? Because yeah, honestly, like, uh, when I was a kid, bro, and I f played this for the first time, um, it was really, like, it was, it was nuts for me. Obviously, as a kid, like, you don't really expect shit, right? Like, you're really naive and stuff. But, like... Man, it's actually been a while since I've been out in the kingdom because ever since you only have to go there like three times, once to every city, and then you can just fast travel, which is kind of nuts, right? But this route is something we remember, of course, because this is what we do, hundred percent. There's a, there's in here. Cause the game's almost over. Might as well get as much mileage as I can, you know what I'm saying? And as much practice as I can for the battle up ahead, upcoming battle. Nice. Didn't mean to do that, but okay, sure. Trying to focus on the. Hidden blade. I grab this guy. Never mind. Yeah, yeah, I go. It's like a very, very strict timing. You, you, you have to get the feel of it. You know what I'm saying? I have to understand. Like that. Exactly. Exactly. It's almost as if like the sword phases through me. You know what I'm saying? We're good. That's it. Done. Easy. And I love how the the hidden blade that you get at the beginning of the game is the same one at the end of, at the end of the game as well. There's no upgrading the hidden blade. The hidden. There's no upgrading the hidden blade because the hidden blade is the most OP. A weapon in the entire game. Perfect stealth weapon, but also a perfect uh, combat weapon. That's why... And I love the simplicity of just, like, one hidden blade. Like, I'll tell you. Right? Otherwise, if you get two, it becomes too easy. You know what I'm saying? That's why you have one hidden blade. That's all you gotta need. That's all you need to read it. 100%. I can't call a horse? Is that what it is? There has to be a horse around here somewhere, right? Because God knows I am not running all the way over there. There she is. There you go. I'm on a white horse. Very apt. So yeah, I'm pretty sure I can get finish this game within an hour. Because there's a lot left to do. All I have to do is go to Arsif, kill Robert, and then come back to Masyaf and kill... Uh, the kingdom, yeah. And kill, what do you call him? I'm all in and the game ends right there. It may be a little more than an hour, but once again, I want to end it in this episode, basically. Because there's not much left to do after this, you know what I'm saying? Here we are. 
our stuff is right there as is stated on the map right this is our last time coming to the kingdom we're just gonna keep we're, we don't have time for this right we're just gonna keep on going all right because um i can't i can't i don't have the time to stop and blend and play it safe you know i'm going to arsif i need to get there before robert makes an alliance with um uh, what do you call him richard all right it's gonna be sick it's gonna be a sick death match right and it really shows the magnitude of how badass Altair really is. Okay, what is it? Arsif? Where's Arsif? There it is. Okay. That's, that's, uh, where, where am I going exactly? Let me see. I, I didn't even do... Okay, so if I come here and then come here... Do I really need to viewpoint these considering I won't be here again? I mean, I could leave a marker. I don't really... Uh, honestly, it doesn't matter. I go down this area, we're good, right? Yes, sir. So I better make... We better be hurry. We, what the fuck am I even talking about? I sometimes I forget how to speak. Basic motor skills, they're gone. Like, I don't know what it is, bro. I think I need to go outside and touch more grass, dog. But what I'm saying is, yeah, um, we gotta make haste to get to Arsuf so we can kill Robert and save the Brotherhood, essentially. And it really shows you how Altair really did it on his own. Bro was literally, he did all this by himself, man. Like, he killed so many dudes, right? And, like, literally no one could stop him. And then you realize why I call him the number one goat of Assassin's Creed. Don't get me wrong, I love Ezio just as much as the next guy, but I'll, you gotta put a second on Altair's name. You can't, you, and to be quite honest, Ezio would be nowhere near where he is right now um, if it weren't for Altair. Altair made his life way easier, you know what I'm saying? What with the codex and shit like that. We are on the right path. Okay, we are good. So yeah, I mean, um, there hasn't been, there's a Templar over there, I'm not gonna fuck with him right now. Um, there hasn't been another protagonist in the series who's as influential and big as I'll tell you, the only person I'd say coming close is probably Bayek since he started the whole thing. And when it comes to Bayek or Altair, I'd probably say that... Do I have to go through here? I think so. Shit. Where am I going? We're almost there though. Shit. Oh no! Oh, I was gonna hit the sword. I knew they could fucking do that. I fucking knew it. We gotta run. Run! I don't have time for this. There's a temple over there. Can I get on your horse? Can I get on? Come on, horsey. Come on. You're good. You're good. You're good. Just gonna chase the horse. And then we'll, we'll get on the horse and then we're good, right? We're good, come on, get, get on, get on, get on, I'll tell you. Get on the fucking horse. Uh, never mind, fuck me. The horse is scared. I probably should fall. Where am I, am I going right? If I have to run, oh, I'm going the opposite direction, dude. Where am I, oh, I, need, I probably need to synchronize the viewpoint because I can't see shit. I think we need to go up from here. Because I don't think there's a passage. Yeah, I don't think there is. I have to go up here. And then, okay, um. Go near the viewpoint, where's the viewpoint? Go, oh, I'm getting chased. <laughs> by a ton of these guys. Gotta make it quick, you know what I'm saying? Go to where the viewpoint is and then go straight. Okay, I can do that. I can do that. Not an issue. Oh, here's a horse. That's nice. Come on, get on the horse. I'll take you on the fucking horse. There you go. Okay. Now we gotta find the viewpoint where the viewpoint is and then go straight from there. Is this the viewpoint? Yeah, I think it is. I came I came the wrong way. Right? Am I where am I going exactly? Yeah, just go straight from here, I guess. Down here? Yeah, I took the wrong turn, my bad. Okay. Yeah. What if I could, what if I go off road? You didn't think about that, stupid. Anyways, just go off road. Simple. Yeah. And Arsif is down here. Correct. It seems like it seems like it is. Yeah. Okay. Cool. We will make it in time. No issues. What so motherfucking ever? Okay. Missed me. Haha. <laughs> okay. I'm honestly just trying to get as much um, gameplay as I can because this game's gonna be over soon, and that's quite sad because this game is just so special to me, right? And uh, I don't find it repetitive at all, man, because I am an assassin, and everything I do, it's feeding into the narrative that I am an assassin. That's why I love this game so goddamn much. But anyways, here we are. We made it one piece. Two are so we're gonna run into uh, Lionheart, Richard. I keep on saying fucking Lionheart, uh, and then we will save the Brotherhood single-handedly save the brotherhood that's how goaded i am okay here we are better hurry up it's a shame we didn't get to see saladin in this game you know what i'm saying would have been cool to see him because we, we saw richard but we didn't see saladin which is kind of weird but anyways oh i can't oh shit okay fuck me i have to, I have, I have to fight these guys fair enough it's like you can't have to let them hit you but at the very last second that's when you that's when you attack essentially Right. I think I got a pretty good idea of what to do. Later. Okay. 
So can we go there now? Or is it blocked? Okay. I think I have to go on foot for this one. Ah, shit. Your life. I'll have your head. I will Come on. Nope, not today. Come on, kill him. There you go. I got it. I got it. I'm a monster. Fuck me. Sometimes you just gotta tank the hit in order to make sure the next hit hits, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so like I was saying, the elite guards, they don't let you throw them around, so sometimes you just have to wait for them to strike, essentially, right? I love that one so much. He just clocked you in the face. Come on, come on, there you go. I'm only using him play, I swear to God. Come on. Atta boy. Let's see it. Come on. Wow, someone, someone shot him? Someone on my side? Someone help me out? Someone just shot him. Weird, but you know, it works. Okay. Oh, you! Why would you be hitting your own dudes, dude? Take this, dick. Okay. Oh, shit. He just said Hashash. Oh, he's speaking Arabic, which means assassin. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's a lot of guys. Do I have to kill all of them, or can I just, like, run? Can I do that? A lot of these guys. Oh, oh my god. Oh, okay, shit. Never mind. Wow, wow. What is going on? Bad. There you go. Do I have to kill all these guys? I don't want to. But I will if I must. You know what I'm saying? Stand right next to a wall and then just get insta kills like this. You know what I'm saying? Here's another one. Another one? Come on. That is good. I must go. Hey, cunts, how's it going? Sorry about that. My mom actually came in. Can you believe it? Out of, out of, out of this entire playthrough, this, the, the one time she does come in and interrupt me is at the very last episode. How fucking dare she? But anyways, yeah, I mean, I started a little differently, but we're basically in the same place. Y'all know the fuck it is. Let's, let's get into it. All right, let's go. Dealing with this shit right now? How about you go over there? Okay, never mind. I don't, that never works, really. I just realized that you can actually do a guard break, a defense break with the dagger. I've actually, it actually happened once. I remember seeing it. I did it right now. Oh, they can counter me too. I didn't see that before. I'm on a roll, man. Let's go. Nice. I want to. I want to work on him, Blade, because I'm about to do the crazy shit right now. Let's go. You can't fuck with us. You know what I'm saying? There's gonna be a lot of guys here. Remember? Yeah. Come on. Come at me. Have at thee. Shank him while he's getting up. Oh, here you go. It's a hack, but it works so well. If you're against a wall, even better, because that way you can get like an instant assassination. You won't have to follow them all the way there, which is great. Come on, hit me. Never mind. If they're not going to hit you, then just throw them, you know what I'm saying? And then, easy kill. 100%. That's the way to go. That's the way to go. That's what we're going to do right now when we face off against Robert. He won't stand a chance. Yeah, this is where I was, right here. Right. Look, like a lot of them come. Apparently, I don't think I can run away either. I have to fight them all. I think I have to fight them all, yeah. Yeah, my back's against the wall. Luckily, I just happen to be the most legendary assassin, like, ever. Shit. Have I ever died in combat in this game? I don't think so. There you go. Good. Not fair. Dick. Get your ass over here. Nope. Get him before he gets up. Before he gets up. Oh, I didn't mind. He was already up. My bad. Nope. Let's try a sword for a little bit. Nope. That worked. Hit him blade again. Mistake. He delayed it, you know? He's playing a goddamn mind game with me. You know what I'm saying? The good thing is that your uh, synchronization bar, essentially health bar, also refills while you're fighting. So you, you can't really die in this game unless if you're really a noob, you know what I'm saying? Lucky for me though, I played this game for 
a little while, so I am not a noob. Oh, he's dead? Wow, okay. Pussy. Last guy, get over here. Take care of you. Oh, the guy, the guy on the ground is what I was trying to look for. Wow, that, that, I missed that somehow. Come on, you buddy. Ooh, yeah, the, 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 the strong ones are the hard ones. The strong attacks, they're hard to deal with. Fuck me, kill him. There you go. Alright, this is the last guy. Easy stuff, easy. Cake work, cake work, buddy, let's go. Cake work, is that anything? Light work. Light work and cake is what I'm trying to go for. Okay, more guys. This is the ultimate test. I can throw him off the cliff, easy. Just exploit this. <laughs> I feel so cheap for doing it, but no, 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 no. I may have taken care of both of your guys that way, but I will not go down like that. Exactly. I'm good at this game, I'm good at this game. Would this be considered cheating if I'm just using the hidden blade? Not really, because it takes skill, you know what I'm saying? It's not like it's a complete get out of jail free card, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, it still takes a amount of skill, right? To maneuver around the place and all that bullshit. Oh shit, wow, those guys straight up ambushed me, bro. What the hell? Not today. There's a lot of these guys, oh my god. Nothing I can't handle, though. Man, I'll tell you such a badass, man. Throwing also makes you invincible while you're throwing the animations. So that's quite nice. Missed. Missed, come on. Shank him, shank him. Fuck me. Find a wall and then... Okay, yeah. So you can't throw everyone. That's the thing, though, right? But we needn't throw everyone, essentially, right? It's like you have to watch the sword phase through you, and at the very last second, you gotta hit the counter button. Once again, it takes skill. No one said it was gonna be easy, but it works. Significant. Once again, practice makes perfect, essentially, right? You find a wall and just abuse. <laughs> Shit! Fuck me. Okay. Abuse the trick. There you go. The very last second, the very last second, you gotta, you gotta shank him. Come on, come on. I wish that, I wish that assassination was more, but obviously I'm pretty sure it's like a bug, right? Like, like if they're on the ground, then you can assassinate them, but I don't think that's, it's, it's, I don't think it's a feature, you know what I'm saying? Who wants it? What the fuck? Oh, he's hitting that guy. Fuck me. No, it's the strong attack. I can't see shit. I can't see shit, bro. What the fuck? That was tough, man. Like, what the hell? I couldn't see shit for a second. Thing is, you're surrounded, right? So while you're in the uh, act of throwing someone, you are open, right? So you don't want that to happen. You don't want to be open. There you go. Like, it's hard. I can't really, like, I don't know how... Like, I have to basically spam the attack button until I manage to assassinate them, you know what I'm saying? Take care of the, the guys with the golden caps first because those guys are, like, elite soldiers or some shit. There you go, right? Just one by one. One kill at a time is all we're looking for, right? It's not like the newer games you can throw a bomb or some shit, right? And just kill five people at the same time. Still somewhat realistic. Even this the, even this isn't realistic, because in, re in reality, no one would wait. My head cannon is so scared of Altair that they, that's why they're not attacking all at once. Because I guess they're just scared. I mean, that's my head cannon, to be honest. I mean, why else wouldn't anyone just automatically jump him, you know what I'm saying? And this is all tell you without the apple, by the way. So, exactly. Yeah, this is easy, dude. Look at my full screen innovation bar. I jinxed it, didn't I? Of course I fucking did. Oh boy, okay. But once again, I'm ready. I'm ready for the final battle. I'm ready for Al Mualim. I'm ready for Robert. We are good. Everyone's dead. Look at these bodies. <laughs> bodies, bodies, bodies. Let's go, man. You can't fuck with me. And I think Robert is right there. Yeah, there he is. No, no, no. This is just a platoon. Do I have to kill these guys too? I don't want to. But I will if I must. Man, I am going through the ringer with this shit, bro. There are so many dudes here. Fortunately, they they can't fuck with me. Whew. Whew. Someone stop me. I'm on fire. I'm going to burn this place down, man. Okay. You found a wall. Fuck me. Bad idea. It's like you need to know when to throw and when to be defensive. Like that. Perfect, right? Get on the ground again. Usually for the second hit, yeah, you can kill him easy. I've thrown this guy on the floor like three times already. Please kill him. Come on, I'll tell you. There you go. Anyone? Step up to the plate. Come on, come on. Kill him, kill him, kill him. What the fuck, I'll tell you. It's weird. It's janky, right? Like, it's not, it's not optimized, obviously. 
Like, you're not meant- this is like- this is like a- Uh, a little glitch you found, right? But like, I don't think it's a feature. You know what I'm saying? I don't think it is. That, however, is a feature. Getting stabbed in the eye. Oh, he's gonna run away? Sorry, buddy. No prisoners. And no witnesses. Actually, let someone be there to t How many men does it take to tell a story? Only one. Tell them of this day. Tell them of this day. And never let them forget my legacy. Exactly. I'm leaving one alive. So we can tell the story to everyone else. Everyone else is gonna die, essentially, right? Here we are. Come no further. Hold a moment. It's words I bring, not steal. Offering terms of surrender then. It's about time. You misunderstand. It's Al Muallam who sends me, not Salah al Din. Assassin! What is the meaning of this? And be quick with it! You've a traitor in your midst. And he has hired you to kill me? Come to gloat about it before you strike? I wouldn't be taken so easily! It's not you I've come to kill. It's him. Speak then! That I may judge the truth! Who is this traitor? Robert. Robert de Sable. Nice. My lieutenant! <laughs> he aims to betray. That's not the way he tells it. He seeks revenge against your people for the havoc you've wrought in Arkham. And I am inclined to support him. Some of my best men were murdered by some of yours. By me. I who killed them, and for good reason. Hear Facts. me out. William of Montferrat. He sought to use his soldiers to take Akka by force. Gagné de la plus. He would use his skills to indoctrinate and control any who resisted. Sabran. He intended to block the ports, preventing your kingdom from providing aid. They betrayed you, and they took their orders from Robert. You expect me to believe this outlandish tale? You knew these men better than I. Are you truly surprised to learn of their ill intentions? Is this true? My liege. It is an assassin that stands before us. These creatures are masters of manipulation. Of course it isn't true. I've no reason to deceive. Oh, but you do. You're afraid of what will happen to your little fortress. Can it withstand the combined might of the Saracen and the Crusader army? My concern is for the people of the Holy Land. If I must sacrifice myself for there to be peace, so be it. The goat. This is a strange place we find ourselves in. Each of you accusing the other. There really is no time for this. I must be off to meet with Saladin and enlist his aid. The longer we delay, the harder this will become. Hold a moment, Robert. Why? What do you intend? Surely you do not believe him? It is a difficult decision, one I cannot make alone. I must leave it in the hands of one wiser than I. Thank you. No, Robert, not you. <laughs> Robert thought he was him. The Lord. Let this be decided by combat. Yes, sir! Surely God will side with the one whose cause is righteous. Mortal combat! If this is what you wish. It is. So be it. Do arms, assassin. Oh, shit. That chills every time. Are they unsheathed their swords? Yo, but Altair stands on business, man. These guys clearly haven't seen all the bodies back there. They clearly have not seen the bodies back there. Fuck me. Kill him, kill him, kill him, come on, kill him. There you go. Yeah, but Altair stands on but he's like so he's like so 100. He's like, yeah, I killed him. And kind of like reminds me of when SEO said the auditory aren't dead. It's me, Ezio, Ezio Auditori, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Same energy, dog. These guys stand on business. Because, you know, they are him. Altair, Ezio, they are him. It's okay to tank a hit. If that means you're going to make sure to nail him on the next one, you know? Like that, exactly. Sometimes I'll take a hit on purpose, just so I can get him. Can I throw him off there? No, okay. But this is good enough. Nope, not today. Get your ass over there. Come on, kill him. Is that really it? After this guy is gonna be uh Robert, and then he's dead, and then and then we're done, right? Yeah. Come on. Come on, let's see it. <laughs> it was that easy. See what I'm talking about? Bro. It's done then. There's no way. Like you are put to rest. 
You know nothing of schemes. You're but a puppet. He betrayed you, boy. Just as he betrayed me. Speak sense, Templar. Or not at all. Nine men he sent you to kill, yes? The nine who guarded the treasure's secret. What of it? It wasn't nine who found the treasure, assassin. Not nine, but ten. A tenth? None may live who carry the secret. Give me his name. Oh, but you know him well. And I doubt very much you'd take his life as willingly as you've taken mine. Who? It is your master, Al Mualim. Don, don, don. Did you never wonder how it is he knew so much? Where to find us? How many we numbered? What we aspired to attain? He is the master of the assassins. We, oui. master of lies. You and I just two more pawns in his grand game. And now, with my death, only you remain. Do you think he'll let you live? Knowing what you do, I've no interest in the treasure. Ah, but he does. The only difference between your master and I is that he did not want to share. No. Ironic, isn't it? That I, your greatest enemy, kept you safe from harm. But now you've taken my life, and in the process, ended your own. Hmm. Robert was kind of a bro, if you think about it. We just didn't know it, essentially. Right? What's going on, Richard? Well fought, assassin. It seems God favors your cause this day. God had nothing to do with it. I was a better fighter. Ah, uh, you may not believe in him, but it seems he believes in you. Before you go, I have a question. Ask it then. Why? Why travel all this way? Risk your life a thousand times, all to kill a single man. He threatened my brothers and what we stand for. Ah, vengeance then. No, not vengeance. Justice, that there might be peace. This is what you fight for? Peace? Do you see the contradiction? Some men cannot be reasoned. Like that madman, Saladin. I think he'd like to see an end to this war as much as you. So I've heard, but never seen. Even if he doesn't say it, it's what the people want. Saracen and Crusader alike. The people know not what they want. It's why they turn to men like us. Then it falls to men like you to do what is right. Nonsense. We come into the world kicking and screaming. Violent and unstable. It is what we are. We cannot help ourselves. No. We are what we choose to be. <laughs> Your kind. Always playing with words. I speak the truth. There's no trick to be found here. We'll know soon enough. But I fear you cannot have what you desire this day. Even now, that heathen Saladin cuts through my men and I must attend to them. But perhaps, having seen how vulnerable he is, he will reconsider his actions. Yes. In time, what you seek may be possible. You were no more secure than him. Do not forget that. The men you left behind to rule in your stead did not intend to serve you for longer than they had Yes. To. Yes. I am well aware. Then I'll take my leave. My master and I have much to discuss. It seems that even he is not without fault. He is only human, as are we all. You, as well. Safety and peace be upon you. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. But anyways, what I'm saying is, uh, uh, oh yeah, we're gonna go back, right? I'm only human after all. Yo, but I mean, I need to do more reading on about like the Third Crusade. I mean, I watched the movie Kingdom of Heaven. I really liked it, but that was between Saladin and Baldwin. I want to see what what he does with uh, I said Richard. Up, God damn it! Listen. Someone's pissy. Oh, no. Seems your assassin friends found us. What? How'd you do it, Desmond? Hey, look, I don't know what you're talking about, but whatever's going on down there has got nothing to do with me. They're here for you, and I sure as shit didn't invite them. What's the situation down there? We're taking heavy fire. Can you contain it, or do I need to evacuate the prisoner? Should I go to sleep? Only five or six. We've got them outnumbered. A couple of wounded, but we'll pull through. We'll get it under control. 
under control. God damn you, Desmond. You couldn't leave well enough alone. I told How do you, you do anything? The fuck did do I do? With this? Like, I, I'm under surveillance like 24-7, bro. Come on. Doesn't matter. They'll be dead soon enough. Here, have a listen. That's been neutralized. Looks like the cavalry won't be coming. Dunno, Doc. We're freaking out a minute ago. Your little research facility not as secure as you thought it was? Worried they'll be back with more? I don't think so, Desmond. What Lucy here is trying to say is that there aren't any assassins left to come for you. We've been very busy this past year, hunting down your little enclaves, your desert communes and whatnot. I'm afraid you're on your own. Rest up, Mr. Miles. Tomorrow, we finish this. So apparently, Desmond wasn't so alone, right? He had friends, and he will continue to have more friends, essentially, right? Yeah, but as I was saying, I want to read up more about uh, Richard and Saladin. What's their dynamic? What's, what's the issue behind that? It looks really interesting, you know what I'm saying? And I love this time period. It's just so freaking cool, Get you know up. what I'm saying? Dick. Even earlier than usual, Doc. I'd like to get this over with as quickly as possible. If you say so. Don't be so glum, Mr. Miles. Today is a historic day. Sure One is. that will be remembered for years to come. Remembered by some of us, anyway. Hmm. Such an ass. Alright, let's go. Let's get it done. Final chapter, we are good. We're gonna go to Masyaf. Everyone's gonna be like, what's going on? And I'll be like, hey, yo. What happened to everyone? But a, uh... Notice when Richard said that, oh yeah, um, people don't know what they want. They need men like us to guide them. That's exactly what Haytham said. The people chose nothing, right? It was done by a group of cr cr privileged cowards seeking only to enrich themselves. They, con they convened in private and made a choice that benefited them. Where is everyone? Gone to see the master. Was it the Templars? Did they attack again? They walk the path. What path? What are you talking about? Towards the light. Speak sense. There is only what the master shows us. This is the truth. You've lost your mind. You too will walk the path or you will perish. So the master commands. It was Al Mualim, wasn't it? What's he done to you? Praise be to the master for he has led us to the light. Even the like the overall ambiance of the place looks different. Is the new color grading? Is that what it is? This place looks different, feels different, right? And honestly, after playing Revelations, I mean, it, it, it brings in so much backstory and depth to the scene right here. What happens, He's... right? How a boss, that dumbass, gets the apple and then he basically fucks himself, right? Uh huh. It, it, that's how it is, you know, 100%. Yo, I don't even think this episode is going to be an hour long, dude. To be honest, like, I'd be surprised if it was an hour long. I think maybe it might end at like 50 or 40 minutes. Am I going to fight these guys? I don't want to kill them, though. Can I just, like, disarm them because they're brothers? I'm gonna have to fight them, I know. Don't worry about me, I'm just... Oh, goddamn. I don't wanna have to fight them. Fuck me. Okay. Looks like I have no choice. Do I have to fight? Can I fight them? Can I run? Dick. Okay, these guys got combos. I forgot these guys have combos. That's quite problematic. Okay, I'm, I'm kind of in a pickle right now. Okay, okay, okay. This is not good. I'm about to die. I did not know these guys were that skilled. Fuck me. Oh, am I fucking dead? Dude, there is... I think it's the first time I actually died in combat in this entire game. There is no way. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, that happened way too quick. I did not see that coming. Not at all. Okay, okay. So I have to fight these guys? I have no choice? Shit, okay. We gotta... Alright. We're serious now, we got this. They're my brothers, but right now they're in my way. So they gotta go, alright? That's the way it is. Fuck me, did hell. Okay. It's the strong attacks that get me, you know what I'm saying? And then they combo it, right? That's even worse. So I gotta go on the offensive and start throwing them. Okay, wow. This, okay. These guys might be stronger than even the even Robert and the other guys, the Templars, you know what I'm saying? I mean these guys are really putting like the herd on me, you know what I'm saying? Like I can't even throw them. Sorry about this. I'm sure you guys will be fine. You see, I can't even throw these guys. God damn. But you can't throw me either, buddy. 
No, not today. I'm gonna grab this guy. Come against the wall. Quick assassination. Come on, there you go. I remember Malik's gonna be here. The OG bro. There you go. You gotta lock in, man. You gotta lock in. There it is. Two more guys left. Yeah, the first time they absolutely jumped me. Wow, I mean, I did not see that shit coming. You know what I'm saying? It's nice how they won't attack me when I'm on the ground. But I have, like, zero honor. Fuck me. No, they're gonna combo, aren't they? Ah, uh, I don't know what I... I pressed the wrong button. It's just one guy, you know what I'm saying? Imagine if this guy kills me. That'd be very embarrassing. Not today. Come on. Come on. There you go. Oh, more guys. Okay, that's nice. Wow, there's a lot of these. Oh my god, okay, wow. No, not today. You gotta lock in, man. That strong attack is like, it's really complex because, like, the timing has to be absolutely perfect, you know what I'm saying? It ain't easy, you know what I'm saying? Fuck me. Fuck me. If I die again, oh fuck. Fuck. You know, if, if you're getting hurt a lot, just run around. That way you'll... Okay, I'm kind of in a pickle right now, guys. Ooh, ooh. Oh. Oh, this is Malak, right? He's over here. Hey, that's the bro right there. He's the bro, 100%. I was actually struggling there, not even gonna lie to you. Because you can only do so much with, um, the... What the fuck? I can't? What? Can't... How do I... How do I go up if I'm not allowed? Yeah, no, Malak really came in clutch over there, bro. He truly is you the a fine time to arrive. A one day one so bro. It seems. Guard yourself well, friend. Al Mualim has betrayed us. Yes. Betrayed his Templar allies as well. How do you know? After we spoke, I returned to the ruins beneath Solomon's temple. Robert had kept a journal, filled its pages with revelations. What I read there broke my heart. But it also opened my eyes. Mm. You were right, Altair. All along, our master has used us. We were not meant to save the Holy Land, but deliver it to him. He must be stopped. Time to die, motherfucker. Malik. What he's done to the others, he'll do to us given the chance. You must stay far from him. What would you propose? My blade arm is still strong and my men remain my own. It would be a mistake not to use us. Distract these thralls then. Assault the fortress from behind. If you can draw their attention away from me, I might reach Al Muallim. I will do as you ask, Dai. The men we face, their minds are not their own. If you can avoid killing them. Yes. Though he has betrayed the tenets of the Creed, it does not mean we must as well. Facts. I'll do what I can. It's all I ask. Safety and peace, my friend. Your presence here will deliver us both. Nice. Ah, uh, see that full circle? Okay, to explain that full circle, in the very first time we met, um, what do you call it, Malik, he said, uh, I'll tell you, said, safety and peace, Malik. And then he says, your presence here deprives me of both. And now he's saying, your presence here will assure both. Of, I don't forget what he said, but it's basically the opposite. So nice full circle there. Excellent writing, by the way. All right. Yes, sir. If this game was like, had a little more depth and it was a little longer, we could probably figure out uh, Altair and Malik's friendship a little more. Because, I mean, really, uh, Malik's the only bro Altair has, you know what I'm saying? Because Abbas is a so fucking cunt. Innocence. I must be careful not to harm them. What are they doing here, man? I gotta own the garden, yeah. I know I know exactly where to go. Don't worry about this. So he's corralled everyone up here? Why? Oh, he's, con he's controlling them, right. Yeah. Yep. Right here. He's gonna fucking... With this thing right here. With this. Time for the final battle. I'm gonna stand right there in the middle. And then boom. No! What's happening? Whoa. His student returns. I've never been one to run. Huh. Never been one to listen, either. I still live because of it. What will I do with you? Let me go. Oh, Altair. I hear the hatred in your voice. Feel its heat. Let you go? Well, that would be unwise. Why are you doing this? I found proof. Proof of what? That nothing is true, and everything is permitted. Come, destroy the betrayer. Send him from this world. 
Man, this 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 is so epic though, honestly. Come on. Let's see it. That was the first guy, right? Okay, never mind. We will use the hidden blade. That is what we will use. I'm on a roll, I'm on a roll. Don't jinx it, motherfucker. Okay, that was cheap. Okay, alright, Doc. You got moves. Okay, I see you. Gotta be careful, gotta be careful. I sometimes forget that I don't... You know what I can do? When they, when they do a strong attack, I can, I can just dodge it. To be honest. Not today. Grab him to make some space. Fuck me, never mind. Come on! I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta guard up. No, fuck off. No. I gotta guard up. Ooh, okay, ouch. It'd be really, it'd be really unfortunate if I just die right here. Run! Am I dead? Fuck! Ah! Uh, run! Run! Run, goddammit, run! <laughs> this is how you get your health back, by the way. Just keep on running. Where are they? Are they chasing me? I can't see them anywhere. They're probably right behind me, aren't they? I just gotta keep on doing this until, uh... Until I get my health back. <laughs> it's so embarrassing. <laughs> but, you gotta do what you gotta do, man. So yes, yeah, they're, they're all obviously illusions of my head, right? That was a mistake. Because the truth is, they're just disguised as my previous targets, but they're actually just those guys. My fallen brethren. Oh, am I bringing the flute, man? Come on. I look like a jackass running around like this. But I'm actually kind of scared, bro. I mean, they, they be laying combos in me. Like, bro, that's not fair. You know what I'm saying? You know what? Fuck yeah, I'm done running. There you go. Hidden blade, let's go. Look at Doc twirling. Okay, fuck me. Mm, not fair. Not fun. There you go. I should probably run. Run until you run. Oh, fuck. Yo, I'm actually struggling, dog. What the fuck is going on, man? I gotta run. Oh, notice how like they're even even when they're talking in battle, it's in character. Cause I th I'm pretty sure I heard Garnier say, uh, "The subject must the subject must not escape." Meaning like uh, like he's talking to a patient or some shit, right? I love that detail, man. I love it. Can I go down here? Yeah, I can. Sweet. I'm just gonna run a marathon. All right, don't worry about me. <laughs> I didn't know it was gonna be this hard, actually, because... Oh, oh shit. Catch this flag while we're at it. Oh, oh, it restores health, that's nice. Okay, I did not know that, actually. That's basically a health pickup, if you think about it. Okay, there's only three guys left we can deal with this, right? Come on, bring it. Where you at? Come, come to me. Alright, buddy. Okay. This fat guy, get over here. Doc is has been giving me trouble, but Doc is gone now, and so is this fat fuck. Lay the fuck down. Let's go. That was hard. That was hard. I'm not gonna lie to you. I was struggling there. Or are you afraid? I have stood before a thousand men, all of them superior to you, and all of them dead by my hand. I am not afraid. Prove it. What could I possibly fear? Look at the power I command. Mm. It's about to get real. It's about to get real in this bitch. Okay? It's about to get real real. Come on. Come on. Get over here. No, I think these guys are easy kills, actually. No, they don't die easily? Okay. I thought they died easily. Never mind. Doesn't matter. Still dead. Okay, so I can't throw them. It's kind of an issue. Because I kind of need to do that. 
But they can't throw me either. Fuck off. I just gotta lock it. Lock it. Lock it. Lock it. It's that combo attack that fucks me up, man. It's not fair. It's not fun. Ooh, dodge, dodge. Fuck me. Okay, shit. That is a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. Not today. Nope. I can't even throw them. Is that what it is? Yeah, I can't. Not at all. Okay, that sucks. Uh, okay, we can still do that, at least. I can dodge it. That's good. Okay. So dodge the heavy attacks, and then when they do the other ones... Fuck me. No, that's a mistake. Ah, oh, fuck me. Okay. Bring out the sword. We gotta survive. No, not today. Nope. Oh, is that the real guy? Where'd he go? Oh, shit. Okay. That was close, man. Damn. Harder than I thought. Called Robert's goal foul, and all along it was yours as well. I've never been much good at sharing. You won't succeed. Others will find the strength to stand against you. And this is why, so long as men maintain free will, there can be no peace. I killed the last man who spoke as such. Bold words, boy. But just words. Then let me go. I'll put words into action. Oh, let's go. <laughs> that aura, that aura, dude. Master, why did you not make me like the other assassins? Why allow me to retain my mind? Who you are and what you do are twined too tight together. To rob you of one would have deprived me of the other. And those Templars had to die. <sighs> but the truth is, I did try. In my study, when I showed you the treasure. But you are not like the others. You saw mm -hmm. through the illusion. Exactly. Illusion. That's all it's ever done. This Templar treasure, this piece of Eden, this word of God. Do you understand now? Red Sea was never parted. Water never turned to wine. It was not the machinations of Iris that spawned the Trojan War, but this! Illusions! All of them! What you plan is no less an illusion. To force men to follow you against their will. Is it any less real than the phantoms the Saracens and Crusaders follow now? Those craven gods who retreat from this world that men might slaughter one another in their names? They live amongst an illusion already. I'm simply giving them another. One that demands less blood. At least they choose these phantoms. Or do they? Aside from the occasional convert or heretic? It isn't right. Ah, and now logic has left you. In its place, you embrace emotion. I am disappointed. What's to be done, then? You will not follow me, and I cannot compel you. And you refuse to give up this evil scheme. Seems then we are at an impasse. No, we are at an end. I will miss you, Altair. Let's fucking go, man. You are my very best student. I am the best still. Come on, come on, old man. <laughs> Same thing with Robert. Same thing. Same thing. When there's a lot, then it's a problem. When there's only one, no issue. That's what you get, old man. Impossible. The student does not defeat the teacher. So it seems. Yes, sir. You have won then. Go and claim your prize. You held fire in your hand, old man. It should have been destroyed. Destroy the only thing capable of ending the crusades and creating true peace? Never. Then I will. We'll see about that. There it is. I applied my heart to know wisdom and to know madness and folly. I perceived that this also was a chasing after wind. For in the wisdom, it's glowing, it's illuminating. And he that increases knowledge increases sorrow. The revelation. Destroy it. Destroy it as you said you would. I, I, I can't. I can't. Yes, <laughs> you can, Altair. But you won't.
Malik's about to show up, I think. There he is. We've got it. By the way, what I said in Arabic, that ba that's basically Arabic for nothing is sure of everything's permitted. Essentially, yeah, yeah. What the hell was that? Uh -oh. Well, we've got the map. How many? At least half a dozen. Shit. We don't need them all. We should assume some amount of decay. I can't imagine they'll all still be functioning. At least two appear to reside on land masses that no longer exist. We'll dispatch teams to each site and determine viability. We only need one, after all. What about the rest? Collect them. Let's not leave anything to chance. Last thing we need is some damn survivor making trouble for us in the new world. And the assassin? We have what we need. Kill him. Shit! Wait. You know how these things work. I doubt we'll be able to walk right in. What's your point? We might need him. His memories. I'd recommend we hold him until we have confirmation that there aren't any surprises waiting for us at the sites. This is a waste of time. Lucy, what to say? Yourself. We shouldn't leave anything to chance. Very well. Ensure we have no further need of him, then kill him. Damn. Fine. Cold. But very characteristic for the suits. They care Stop nothing for human life. Authority. I just saved your ass. Let's go. We've got a lot of work to do. Don't get too comfortable, Mr. Miles. We'll be back for you soon enough. Shit. So where it ends, eh? Oh, what the hell is that? There it is. Your spice kicking in. She's an ally, is that right? Eagle Vision kind of bugging. Now, obviously, at this point in the game, I feel like Lucy was supposed to be like a long-time character, but because of the whole dispute with Kristen Bell, they had to kill her in Brotherhood. So I think until this point, she was supposed to be a double agent, and then until she became a triple agent in Revelations, that's what it... Yeah, but I mean, I remember as a kid walking around just looking at these symbols, like, what the hell is all this? And trying to decipher it, and there are people on the internet like who are like showing like meanings to all this, like there's like a verse... There's like a verse from the Quran or from the Bible written in this or something, right? It's not serious. It's gonna shot right here, right here. Right here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Like 22, 13, like what is that? A verse from somewhere? It looks like. Is that blood? What does it mean, I wonder? What the hell were they keeping here before me? I entered the abyss and I never. What happened to him? And I never returned. What does, what does it, mean, it mean, I wonder? I wonder. And then. Zoom. And. Done. Just like that, it's done. Can you believe it? Bro, there's no way. I gotta keep this music on because it's just so sick. Oh my god. Take, just take a second to take that in. Alright, just relax, chill, sit back and just take that in. What do you just witness, dog? Oh my goodness, we have a lot of time on the clock. We're gonna talk about this, right? But I mean like... Oh my god. It's, it's good, right? It's fucking good. I mean, okay, for, for the very first game, obviously, it had an immense amount of potential. Thankfully, the sequel didn't disappoint. Assassin's Creed 2 picks up right off, uh, picks up right after this, right? The assassins come, and then we have to send the trunk, and then Lucy takes us somewhere else, and then we meet Sean and Rebecca. Yeah, so yeah, and no, once again, like this, it, so so we're gonna get better from here until like Syndicate. I feel like, well, not not even really, because I feel like Assassin's Creed 3 essentially killed the franchise. Because okay, if you did not know, originally uh, Assassin's Creed 3 was supposed to be the last game. It wasn't supposed to be more than that. Like, uh, Desmond was supposed to, like, take down the Templars and that's it. Right? But guess why? Guess what? Take a wild guess. Why do you think the franchise is still going? It's because of money. It's because of money. It's because it's doing too good, monetary-wise. So that's why we have, like, 13 fucking entries now. Mainland entries. It should have died years ago. Right? Okay, imagine if Assassin's Creed died with Assassin's Creed um, 3. Imagine it would be, like, the most legendary series in, like, the history of gaming. One of the most, right? And it would be celebrated by everyone, right? But obviously now, with subsequent entries and all the fatigue and all that bullshit, it's lost its magic. And Assassin's Creed has lost its original vision, right? That they were intending to do because they had a they had a game plan, right? We're gonna we're gonna do this and this game, this and that game, and then have an overarching modern day plotline. And essentially, modern day plotline that's like the main thing. That's the main story, because what happened in the past is in the past, right? We're just reliving that. But the the real story of Assassin's Creed is in the modern day. Right, and that has been has been dragging on ever since Assassin's Creed 4. Ever since Assassin's Creed 4, 
then it was Unity that was basically nothing. Syndicate, Origins, Odyssey was basically nothing either. I mean, we had Layla, which is... I don't really like her, to be honest. I mean, she wasn't really interesting at all. Um, but um, luckily, though, strangely enough, Valhalla actually fixed that. And they actually gave us one of the better modern days of um, the, pr the, the previous years, right? The most recent years. Because we actually had a, a, a protagonist now. We have Basim, right? So, I mean... That's why I'm kind of like curious to see what like what what's the future for the modern day. I haven't played Mirage yet. I really want to because I want to see where the modern day goes. If anything, I'm more interested in the modern day now more than ever. You know what I'm saying? But obviously, th all that uh, stuff written around the ground that was Subject 16. We will see him in um, what do you call him? Revelations in the flesh, essentially. Not in the flesh because he's not real. He's just code. But like whatever. You know? Mm, goddamn! What a good fucking story, man. We one-shotted Al Mualim. He didn't get a hit off of me. It's only an issue when there's a lot of them. Because then you have to focus on multiple people. But, you know, I guess there's no excuse. I guess it's just a skill issue. But, I mean... I, enough said, buddy. Enough said. I mean, this fucking game, man. And then you wonder why it's, like, one of my favorite Assassin's Creed games of all time. Because of that. Because of the vibe. Because of the philosophical themes. Because of the political themes. Because of the meta commentary. Like, come on. Come on. You, you, you can't say that. I mean, this isn't a mirror of our world. You're trying to tell me there isn't, like, a... There aren't... Uh, mega corporations and secret societies who control the world of course they are of course they are and um if you know a lot about biblical text and quranic text and a lot about history and shit then you would know i feel like the most informed people in terms of like the end of the world and apocalypse and shit are like jews muslims and christians because they have the holy books right and if you decipher them you can essentially find out what's going to happen right and you can't tell me that the templars aren't supposed to be like the illuminati or the freemasons you know, because those guys control shit in the real world today. In the actual real world, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Th there's a reason why, I mean, this shit, it, 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 it sucked me in. Pause. Um, when when I was a kid, I, I became obsessed with the franchise after this game. I, I could not wait till the next, um, uh, what do you call it, entry because I just wanted to know what happens. Right? I just wanted to know what happens. Goddamn. I mean, shit. Are we done? Or where are we right now? Can we? Are we, are we done? Or do we... Do we go to sleep? or Because uh, Lucy's gone. I can go to sleep? No, I can't go to sleep. Can I go over here? I've been to the washroom like once. When I was like spying on them. You can't use this. No. Oh, that's cool. You can just, For no reason you can just go in there. I guess that's interesting. Uh, Anything else we can do? Because this is the end game, right? I guess we can just like... You can replay memories, I think. But like memory blocks. Not a specific memory. Because once again, this is the first game. Obviously can't use this. Be oh, I can. Oh, okay. But Lucy's not even here. Who's gonna Who's gonna plug me in? You know what I'm saying? Kind of forgot what happened in the end game. I think this is it, right? Yeah. You don't. You after this, that's that's pretty much it. I mean, yeah. See, yeah. Memory block four, and then additional memories, and yeah, memory block seven. All mall in paradise. What is additional? What is that? Additional memories. Oh, the flags. Yeah, I'm not doing that, bro. So if I if I do, so what what does it take to get a full synchronization? Hmm. So yeah, those um those blue lines, all these. This is so basically, if you see a blue line anywhere, that means they're collectibles. So you can just ignore those. And um, these these ones, like the the white ones, the the black ones that haven't been white, those must have been like the citizens or some shit, right? But yeah, I mean, we still got it done. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but not much else for us to do. I mean, this is pretty much it. This is Assassin's Creed. One, that was it. That's done. And this is probably the last time I'm playing this game because I've already played it so many times. This is probably like my third or fourth playthrough. I played it when I was a kid. Um, I played it uh, like back in 2018 and now I'm playing it again. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, I, this game will always have a special place in my heart because of what it is. And you've been here with me throughout the entire way. So, I mean, congrats. We made it, fellas. Uh, we had some ups and downs along the way. But, you know, at the end of the day, we pushed and we made it. Right. Just got to thug it out and we are good. But, I mean... I also had to mention that Altair is an atheist. I didn't know that. He was an atheist. Because he doesn't believe in God. I remember Richard said that. Um, it makes sense why they didn't make him an explicit Muslim. Because, I mean, that would raise controversy. Oh, Muslim terrorists, you know, assassin. Yeah, I mean, even though that's true, though. The assassins in real history were Shiite Muslims. So, yeah. Desmond just chilling, man. Oh, my God. I can't wait for Assassin's Creed 2. One of the best games ever, Assassin's Creed 2. One of the best sequels. One of the best games. Still the best Assassin's Creed game of all time. Oh, my God, man. But, I know, we're not actually going to play Assassin's Creed 2 after this. We have to finish. Drum roll. Okay. Let me... Uh, give me a drum roll. I can't hear you, but give me a fucking drum roll. We have to finish. Where the fuck is it, dude? I swear to God, I have so many games. Where is it? Is it here? Yeah, we have to finish. Drum roll, please. Boom. 
Deadpool PS4, and now's the perfect time to finish it because uh, Deadpool and Wolverine just came out yesterday. I want to see it in theaters, but I don't have. I don't know. I don't know if I want to go. Like, how am I supposed to go? You know, what I'm saying like I can't just go by myself, right? I don't have any friends, so I mean, who am I gonna take? Because imagine going to theaters alone. I mean, I guess it's a vibe, right? You can go to theaters alone. Like, no, there's no rule that you can't, right? Um, and if anything, you'll chill more, right? It's like a better experience. I don't know, but it's it does look kind of fucking pathetic that you're just sitting there alone munching on popcorn while there's a there's a couple next to you making out or some shit. Like, get a fucking room, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, yeah, um, Deadpool is is out next. I'm gonna finish that game. It's gonna be better now because we have better recording technology, better um a mic uh, for one, right? So and uh better oh he, he's sleepy he's like he's like dozing off yeah that's funny ah <sighs> what else do i have to say about the game perfect amazing great so good for, especially with the first game for ex for an experimental type shit i mean i don't know what else to say i mean it, I've, I've been sucking this game up for so long and you already know what the fuck it is man i mean this thing right here you want to talk about Alam Walim? i mean it's pretty self-explanatory i mean he got he was essentially the biggest templar of the entire time and the entire all the people we were trying to get rid of Sure, there are bad people, but essentially they were the targets that Um Wallen wanted gone because he wanted the apple all to himself. And essentially, Robert was kind of true the whole right the whole time. We didn't know because, uh, you know, we, we we believed in Um Wallen, but he he goddamn he he really fucked us up. And I almost got fucked up at the end over there. I nearly died. I did die once, and I was saved by Malik once. And then the other time I had to run around like a goddamn hooligan. Yeah, I mean, I didn't I did not expect them to pull out the the big guns, but I guess it is the end game. So if they weren't going to pull it out at the end, then where were they going to pull it out? But yeah, that was a pretty good, obviously one of the most memorable um, endings, one of those memorable boss fights, one of the most, one of the better uh, villains, right? I would consider Amalim a villain. Yeah, he's definitely the villain. And it's, what's special about that is that um, you don't see the villain, right? Like at least in Assassin's Creed, I mean, oh, Ro Ro Rodrigo Borgia, bad guy. Cesare Borgia, bad guy, right? Like we know those guys are bad, right? And Assassin's Creed 3, Charles Lee, give me Charles, right? Gimme Lee, right? Um, but in this one, the entire time, we didn't even know who the real villain was. We were bamboozled. We were gaslighted into thinking that it was Robert this entire time, but the entire time, it was on Wallen. That's why it's like one of the best stories in this series, I feel like. It's, it's written so well, and the writing's so good. What with the whole full circle with Malik? Yeah, I mean, I got... Uh, the, less, the, the more I say about this game, the less I really do have to say, because I already said it all. Yeah, man, I mean, I don't even know what else to say. I mean, goddamn, this game's fucking perfect, man. It's perfection, goddammit. And I feel like once again, like only like old school Assassin's Creed fans are gonna realize this. But like if you're like if you haven't played Assassin's Creed in 2024 and you're playing this game, you may you may think it's dated. But if you if you stick by it and really let it like, you know, blossom, then you'll see it's like one of the best narratives I've seen, right? And once again, I just can't I still can't get over like the real world commentary that this game does, right? Like what would you know, like the all the secret societies collecting secret treasure. Yeah, I mean it's it's so on the nose. Like like if you know what your shit, then it's like right in front of you. Right, but to, to those who are uninformed, they're gonna be like, "Ooh, I don't know." But like, you know, since we know, you know, and they not like us, I mean, you already know the fuck it is, man. But yeah, if you know, you know exactly what's happening in the real world, and you know, the Antichrist and all that bullshit. Oh, damn. Anyways, but anyways, that was. I gotta tell you to say that was Assassin's Creed One playthrough. Fuck yes, can't wait to play Assassin's Creed Two after playing Deadpool and finishing that game because you already know what the fuck it is. Um, yes, yes, and I will see you next time. Assassins.